Hello, this is Matt Krause, and welcome to today's edition of English Bites. The headline that I wanted to call your attention to today is this one, Europe braces for new fiscal battles. And I wanted to call your attention in particular to this word, to this verb, braces, to brace. Europe braces for new fiscal battles. And to brace means to prepare or to get ready for or to anticipate. So you could just as well say in this headline, uh, Europe anticipates new fiscal battles or Europe prepares for new fiscal battles. The difference between to brace and to prepare or to get ready for, to prepare or to get ready for is, of course, the, the more general verb or the more general word. So you can use it without worrying as much that you're going to make a mistake or that you're going to get into trouble. Uh, this word to brace is a little more specific, so be a little more careful with it. Uh, this word to brace, it means to prepare for something by getting ready for defensive action, like holding on to something or stiffening your muscles or somehow like getting ready with defensive action. And so, And this is a, a, a common phrase that you can use in other contexts. One of the most common contexts is the phrase brace for impact, and it means get ready for a crash, brace for impact. It means hold on to something, stiffen yourself, put your head down, get ready for a crash. The crash is coming. Get ready for it to brace for impact. 